from the lips of children and infants, you, Lord, have called for your praise. Matthew chapter 21, verse 6. What's me? What's my fairy princess dance, Grandma? My three years old daughter, gleefully called, as she raced around the yard of our cabin, a big grin on her face. Her dancing brought a smile in her big brother's glam. Just not dancing, just running, didn't squelch her joy at being on a vacation with family. The first Sunday was a day of highs in the when Jesus rode into Jerusalem on a donkey, the crowds enthusiastically shouted, Hosanna! Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Yet many in the crowd were expecting a Messiah to free them from Rome, not a Savior who would die for their sins that the same week. Later that day, despite the anger of the Chiefs who questioned Jesus' authority, children in the temple express their joy by shouting Hosanna to the son of David, perhaps leaping and waving palm branches as they run around the courtyard. They couldn't help but praise and worship him. Jesus told to the indignant leaders from the lips of children and infants, God called for his praise. They were in the presence of the Savior. Jesus invites us also to see who He is. When we go, like a child overflowing with joy, we can help but reveal in His presence. Let us reflect and pray. How do the daily destruction and discontent of others draw your focus away from God? What will help you to keep your eyes on Jesus? Let us pray. Loving God, thank you for all you have done for me. I'm amazed at the great lengths you went to so that I could find joy in you. Help me to keep my focus firmly on you. Amen. Be blessed beyond mission.